Hey guys, this is Charlie from Bunyip Island, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to absolutely all the time uh, be able to safe spot Jad uh, with the new Slayer Caves update. I've known about this pretty much since like the day the Slayer update came out, or the Slayer update, the Fight Caves update came out. Um, however, I didn't make a video on it, um, and I have no idea why I didn't, because it could help a lot of people um, both do Jad Slayer tasks and um, you know, uh, get their first fire cape, which is always a great feeling to get your first fire cape. So, yeah, I'm just doing this uh, wave, this last wave, and then I will be running to the safe spot. The safe spot, just so people know, is right here. Let's see what's going on my game. Overloads one off. Perfect. The safe spot's right here. And Jad will either spawn over there on the other side, and you'll be able to see his big scary Jad face over there. He might spawn here, um, however I'm not sure, but most of the time he will either spawn in the middle, far over there, or far over there, meaning that he'll be drawn to exactly where this magical fire cat of doom is standing. Um, so yeah, I'll just get on it. Okay, so Jad has spawned somewhere, not sure where he is. Sometimes he does take a while to show up, uh, because he just has to slowly trudge all the way along the map, and there he is, with his big scary Jad face. So yeah, that's how you always lure Jad. Anyway, yeah, easiest method of luring Jad, and Ganodermic means that he does absolutely no damage, and free 25k Slayer XP, meaning I'm, I'm nearly there, I'm, I'm getting to 99. 